Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty with something really amazing. The new Jack Thunder aftermarket kit for the RGL-80. It's the most fun I've had in COD in forever. And so many people have been using it in my lobbies that they may change the name of this game to Call of Duty Jack Thumper 1. Anyway, how do you get it? Well, you've got to complete five of seven of the week four season four challenges and these things were all over the map. I used two primary weapons, the Moors and the Holger 556. I used three launchers. I used the RGL-80 at the end, but I also used the Joker and the Pila. So quickly going through these, yeah, Stunder Blinded, 10 of those, we know how to do that. 10 with a bomb drone or mosquito drone. I used the mosquito. I got those in a couple of games. Place on the top of the leaderboard three times. It took me five games. In one of the games, I got three VTOLs and still was second to one of my teammates. In the other game, there was a CDL professional player on the enemy team, and he scored 77 of the one. 125 GAX that they used to vanquish us. Three double kills with grenades or launchers. I used the Joker for that because what it does is it lob shells high and they come from nowhere and hit a cluster of the enemy. It's really funny. And then 20 GAX while using high explosive. That's the Moors with the explosive. Incendiary rounds do not count for this challenge. I tried it. So I pulled out the Moors. It's a recommended weapon. And I put the explosive rounds on it. Destroy eight aerial kill streaks. That's what I use the Pila for because it's the easiest launcher to get rid of the counter UAVs and the UAVs. And you got to hope people are going to put them up. Then finally, three kills after death. And I use proximity mines and thermites for that. In, in fact, most of these happened. I didn't get a flash. I didn't even know it until I checked the status on the end game status. So let's go back to the RGL-80. The, the main thing about it is that you can put different ammunition, different types of ammunition on it. You have the 40 millimeter slug, and that's really just an impact round. So I didn't see how that was any better than just the default where you gack people on impact, plus you have a little explosion at the end. The 40 millimeter sticky. I tell you, this thing was so much fun. You lob a grenade, it sticks somewhere. It's like a sticky grenade. So there are a lot of times where I stuck somebody, they gacked me, they ran away, and guess what? But they also exploded. I got two quad feeds in a row on this. Quad feed, die, quad feed, keep going. So it's a fun one. And then the 40 millimeter drill charge. It's like a drill charge, except you have six of them. And it'll also work like a sticky grenade in that you can stick it to people. Oh, and by the way, this one will kill the shield holder. So they're not safe from this one. I don't know about the sticky grenade. Maybe somebody who's tested it can comment below, but definitely drill charge. I got multiple kills on people coming at me with shields. So like I said, you're going to have to equip yourself with this thing. You do those challenges because if you don't have fun with them, somebody else on the enemy team is going to be having fun and you need this thing for self-defense. So let's go on down to the field of honor and see how each one of these types of ammunition perform. All right, we're going to start with default ammo. This is how it comes from the factory. And in case you've been wondering why there have been so many explosions lately, let me tell you, it's the thumper. And I'm going to try to use it as my primary weapon. I only have six shots, so every now and then i got to switch. And I've already done a video on the default RGL-80. Getting it to Interstellar. It's really like a little shotgun. You can directly hit people or there's going to be an explosion with the default ammo if you can hit them. And the Jack Thumper is supposed to increase the distance and the velocity. 
of the rouse. Ooh, there's a good hit. Yeah, the guy backed into me. So the default ammo pretty much works the same, except for the increased velocity, which I really am not going to be able to test on shipment. I guess uh, I, I did go to rust. This is a 40 millimeter sticky round, and it worked fine. This, what's neat about this is if you use this as your primary, you may get yacked, like right there, but I stuck him. So he's going down. He's going to join me in the respawn bill. Is that a mouse? Or is that a rat? So you can actually surround the objective with sticky grenades or an enemy and they will explode later so very effective I really enjoyed the sticky I mean I was laughing many times this is the one I got the dual quad feeds on and then yeah I enjoyed it a lot of fun and you're putting out a lot of explosives The guy is stuck. He's coming around to get rid of me, get me off the hard point, and he's bringing a grenade with him. I'm laying down, and he exploded. Just something I haven't experienced before in a decade and a half of COD. This is a unique weapon now. And I imagine people are going to get tired of exploding because Everybody's going to get this. If you don't, you'll be one of the few without it. I advise to take the ammo box because then you can reload. Looking for a place to get out of this corner here. I'm kind of trapped. Okay. Now I'm just asleep. Wanted to see if I can get some more. Nope, out of ammo, so I got to use the primary. Which you're going to have to do every now and then because you don't have infinite ammo. Okay, back to thumping. That's about as much as Grandpa smiles right there, and I will smile on the whole time. All right, so the sticky is actually a good weapon. It's an excellent weapon. Here's the slug. I didn't like the slug as much because the only the only way I see you're going to get the enemy is with a direct hit. Now, coming at him, you can shoot at him six times. But this is more like a, a sniper w w weapon. I, w I wouldn't call it necessarily a shotgun. It's more like a sniper without the, uh, without the range. And with better fire in terms of rate of fire. I just don't see a need to beat someone with a with an empty thumper. I just don't see the need for the slug, to be honest with you. If you can think of a need for the slug, what purpose it serves that is not served otherwise, maybe a little bit of distance, then please comment below and let me know what you think the purpose of the slug is. Look at that guy. Pretty fast. There's a double kill with the direct hits. Like I said, I tried to be as honest as possible with it in terms of just using another double kill. Just using the thumper until I ran out of ammo. And I wasn't going to go around and grin at him, make mean faces. And that one there, I did get a hit. But uh, anyway, oh, that was a drill charge. We're on to the drill charge, which is the final 
final ammo type and it's a lot like the sticky in that you can stick it to somebody and get a kill after after life kill man i just had to beat that guy up because i couldn't hit him he kept moving pretty rude see how you can you can stick them and you can stick shields too there's a stick but one thing to remember when you stick somebody they can still shoot at you now like the sticky you can drop these things around a point and they will eventually explode i put it through the wall to try to get i got see i got some damage on somebody shooting through the wall So every once in a while I did have to use the primary, which was the Holger 556. Coming out with a video on that in this configuration, as a matter of fact. A lot of kills with it though. This is a deadly machine. Especially in close quarters. See there? Double kill after life. But like I said, I was I was laughing a lot. Because people would just go, whoa, what just happened? Or, dang, when that explode. This turned out to be a fairly tight game. I mean, you can get the knifers with it, that's for sure. It's a one-shot kill on the knifers now. If you can get an impact kill, that's best. There's a shield. And see, I stuck it. Stuck them both, as a matter of fact. I got the shield guy. See, if you can get an impact right up next to their ear, there's another stick on the shield. And killed by somebody in the campground. Anyway, let me know how you like it. Please like and subscribe this video. Let me know if you're going to try to get the thumper and actually use it. Cheers. Peace to you.